Here's 5 facts you may not know about the ghost type. Starting with some side games, in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, ghost types can skip the whole floor layout thing and just walk through walls entirely, although doing so rapidly depletes the player's belly, so it isn't the best long-term strategy. Speaking of long-term, it took Ash in the TV show a long time to get a ghost type. In fact, Ghost was the very last type Ash officially owned once he captured his Gengar in 2020. Speaking of the show, Ghost can be a bit confusing there. On one hand, Ghost types have been shown to die on multiple occasions, yet there are some that seem to live indefinitely. So not all Ghost types are Ghosts, but all Ghosts are Ghost types? Going over to the main series games, until the introduction of the move Poltergeist in the Gen 8 DLC The Isle of Armor, every Ghost type move was 100% accurate. Even then, Poltergeist is only 90%, so they didn't lose out much. And for the last fact, ghost types are f***ing cool. If you don't think so, 